Kenny, leading up to tonight's main card opener, Dustin Poirier said he wanted to be more defensively sound <laughs> against Jim Miller. He said he kind of got into a uh, uh, too much of a scrap with Michael Johnson here. But yeah. once the bell sounded, he just kind of went back to slugger mode. <laughs> exactly. Someone <laughs> turned the switch on. On Poirier, he went right back to what he did against Johnson, but he was more successful. I, and Miller isn't the, the same kind of striker that Michael Johnson is and certainly doesn't have the same kind of speed. And because of that, Poirier uh, kind of lucked out here. But I thought it was a solid performance from him. I thought he kept his hands up a little bit better, moved his head a little bit better as well, and, and poured it on uh, against Jim Miller. Jim Miller is one of those guys. He's a veteran fighter. He's been around the sport for a very long time, a true warrior. Uh, this was a big win for Poirier. I, I thought he looked good overall. I think Poirier definitely landed the harder shots throughout the fight. It wasn't until the third round when Jim Miller started to land those calf kicks that it really slowed down the striking ability of Poirier. But then Poirier smartly, as a veteran move, took the fight to the ground. He knew he wasn't going to be able to push off that calf, took the fight to the ground, rode out that third round, and got the win. Yeah, Kenny, what did you make of his adjustments there with that injury as he fought? I thought it was re really impressive. You know, yeah. when your leg is limited like that, it's hard uh, to, to throw any strikes. You can't put your weight on there. And he kept attacking the exact same spot over and over. It took away his balance. It was affecting the way he was putting pressure on that lead leg. And he mixed things up. I thought it was very smart. That shows how experienced and how smart he is to go in and, and adjust and look for the takedown so he wouldn't have so much pain in that leg. Yeah, I also do like Dustin Poirier as a lightweight, more than a featherweight there. Definitely. You know, he was saying a lot that. more energy. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Well, quick update from Megan O'Levy. Both Poirier and Jim Miller were beat up and in pain. They were taken to the hospital as a precautionary measure.